name is Raya Shatara. I'm with ST Microelectronics, the automotive group. Uh, and I'm here to present to you the hybrid software defined radio. And uh, I just want to, before we go into the details of, the, uh, of this product, I just want to explain to you what the hybrid means. Uh, simply the hybrid uh, with, that we do the analog broadcast services on the ST parts and all the digital broadcast services like uh, HD radio, uh, digital uh, audio broadcast in Europe DEB or the future CDR. Uh, DRM in India and Australia, it'll be done in the standard capable SOC from uh, different vendors. Uh, and our tuners basically interface with this SOC so they can do the digital services, we do the analog services. And that's the reason we have, we call it hybrid. Uh, so what I'm presenting to you here, uh, <clears throat> here's the ST, ST tuners. This is basically uh, a small tuner module uh, that can fit by the antenna. It takes two antenna inputs, uh, it could, and it can do uh, six channels. And these six channels could be uh, transferred through this high data speed bus here, about 10 meters, uh, and different vendors make this kind of technology, so we can work with uh, different ones. And this data is being shipped through the 10 meters, in this case, to a, a standard capable SOC that does, that can implement the uh, digital broadcast services. Uh, and the unique thing about this, uh, the power also can come through this bus uh, and commanding the tuners, the three tuners that we have on this board. Each tuner is two channels, so in total six. And this is to cover most of the, uh, the, the challenging use cases of the OEM, uh, the automotive manufacturers, uh, for, uh, uh, for broadcast receivers. Uh, and basically, the most demanding use case would be in Europe. You would need a DEB uh, for MRC. MRC is the diversity, digital diversity system, which is stand for maximum ratio combiner. It will take two channels. And the phase their AMF and phase diversity uh, will take another two channels uh, that run simultaneously. And uh, you would need a fifth channel for DEB background, to, for uh, background scanning, so they can see what's available stations, uh, traffic information, and so forth. And the last channel would be the FM background tuner uh, for the analog services. So that in total, that this small board can handle six channels uh, that transferred over the high data speed of bus to an SOC here again. And here's uh, another version of that, which is showing it's up and running, it's functioning, and you can see we are tuned to a station here in uh, Silicon Valley uh, to uh, a station that we're receiving in this building uh, with two antennas that you can see in the back. And uh, just to touch on some of the algorithms that ST have for the analog services is a work class that runs on our part and basically we can cover all the use cases uh, from phase diversity, uh, channel equalization and so forth. Uh, because the automotive demand for uh, better reception for analog signals is uh, becoming more challenging in a challenging mobile environment. So these algorithms, like, it gotta be automotive grade. And, and that's what we worked on many years of that to get them to this, uh, to the automotive level grade. Uh, the other thing is, uh, I'm showing a picture of this board here that you can see each, uh, the AMFM run on, the, on this part, TDA 7707. Uh, the other two parts are RF to bits parts. Basically, we digitize all the antenna um, uh, signals here and we, transfer the data over this high-speed data bus here to, to the main SOC board here. And this SOC does the DAB, DAB diversity, HD background, uh, and the uh, uh, HD MRC as well, uh, cases in the US. So you would need three tuners for the US uh, for HD MRC and uh, the background, one for background, um, and the phase diversity for analog. And then you would need also uh, six tuners for uh, Europe. Um, and it's a flexible system. We, you can update the algorithms through uh, uh, over-the-air update, depending on the SOC vendor that you're using for your product. Uh, and you can also customize. You can put some customized uh, algorithms in the SOC. Uh, and last, uh, the family of the uh, for the software-defined radio from ST are uh, two special parts. It's the STA710. Uh, that is two channels, and it takes. Uh, it has multiple inputs. It can handle two FM. Uh, antennas, uh, it has a DEB front end, and it has a weather uh, front end, and of course the AM. And it can interface through any SOC through our uh, 
uh, i squared s interface or the uh, LVDS uh, for low noise interface. Same thing, the STA709 is a single channel. It's a derivative, basically, from the STA710, but it does single channel, but uh, as the same interfaces. Um, and that, and this is, we show a live demo today of this, uh, of this product, and this product has been tested in the vehicle uh, here in, uh, in Silicon Valley, and it's been tested in Europe as well for DAB, uh, and it is, it is functional, and uh, I would say uh, ready to go to production. And thank you.